Hey everyone, this is Shane from Game With Gas, and today we return to Planet Zoo. Uh, there's actually been some updates to the game since I last played this. I'm not sure what, what they are, so maybe we might run into some of those. But we're going to bang on with um, setting up a couple of new habitats and also establishing a transport ride. And so those who have played this studio's former game, um, Planet Coaster, I think it's called, um, they would be very familiar with setting up transport rides because it's basically the same concept, but just with building an amusement park instead of a zoo. Um, but we'll go through um, how to do it here in the Planet Zoo. So here we go, Zookeepers, Planet Zoo. Okay, so we set up the gorilla. Now we need to set up for the orangutan. They've got the basics, but not everything to make them happy. So let's. They need more short grass, a hell of a lot less long grass, and some more soil. So let's get them some short grass. This is way easier than mowing. I'm give them some short grass over here. Now we need to give them some soil. They like a lot of soil. Let's give them some heavy soil. All right, and they like a little bit of rock, so let's give them a little bit more of that. That looks pretty good. Oh, the size of the habitat's fine. They need climbing stuff. Coverage, though. They need not only climbing stuff. We'll do the climbing stuff now. What should we put? Get some climbing stuff here. And there we go. Now we've got enough climbing stuff, so let's give them some coverage. It says Asia Tropical. And we'll just do plants. Here we go. There we go, finally. Now we need enrichment items. But we'll go up to the Zoopedia. And we'll use, we'll, this will tell us what we need. They need, for toys, sprinkler, large ball. They like to play a lot. It's still way low on enrichment. Small ball, grab ball, ice block. Where's the small ball? I don't want a snowball. I 
Oh, it looks like maybe Africa Park expansion is the, in the new update because I'm seeing stuff in here that I haven't seen before. Still more toys. Ice block cardboard box. Still going. A bobbin and a mirror mobile. From the looks of that, um, you could put basically anything you like in here. And I'll give them another type of bobbin drum. There we go. Plenty of stuff to play with. Now, food. Um, they love forage boxes, so I'll give them that and a tree forager. something else but it's that's just over okay for them large fixed roller feeder wait that's not what I wanted one of that Okay. All happy. All happy days. So there's our beautiful orangutan habitat. Where are you going? What are you doing? Are you going to go play with one of these? You sure are. <laughs> You're not feeling very playful. What about the other one? Are you doing stuff? Wherever you are? There we go. Nice view of the orangutan scratching itself. Very pleasant. Okay. Now, did I set up the habitat boards and stuff? Oh, just need to put that in. There we go, so everybody can hear all about it. We have got money yet? Oh, wow. $1,200 in donations. People love this. All right, for the next part. Oh. The inspector has left report ready for... Oh, what? I've never seen a zoo inspector before. That must be new. The zoo has no security guard. All right. Let me just fix this up. Oh. Are you okay? Yep, you're fine. You're sleeping. Um, all right, so let's just we'll hire a security guard and put them in just to make this thing shut up. Security 
boink. But now, oh, I can't remember where it is. Transport rides. This is what we're going to do next. Now, I've never been that good at these transport rides, like setting them up, because they are a little bit tricky. But we'll do our best, and hopefully I can show you how it's kind of done. Um, I'm going to pick gondola because um, you can see here that you can have a transport, which is just a 4x4, uh, monorail, riverboat, small steam train, and suspended gondola. I, I love the suspended gondola, so I'm going to going to do that. Now, the most important things with these transport items is that the the track, um, or in this case, the you know the aerial cabling, and it all has to be a loop and you put stations in the loop for people to get on and off. So you can't like start a cable car like at one corner and then have it end at another corner. It has to loop all the way around. So we'll start off by putting a station in and I'm expecting this to be trouble because it always has been. Yeah, let's spin you around, I think. Put another station in. Okay, so we've reached the limits of where we can go. So let's well, let's turn this around. Okay, so that should be our loop. Put a couple of stations in here. Um, I might put station in over here. Okay. You can see all of our stations are closed. I don't know why that one jumped to 10, but anyway. Um, we need to connect these up to paths. Beautiful.
Okay, now we've got all of our stations with what they need to actually work. Maybe we should put more vehicles in. Looks like I just opened it without testing it, but um, we'll test it in the wild. Well, there's going to be some people on board. Just before I do that, one of the cool things about this is you can customize the coloring of everything. Track color. Make that orange. Um, the car colors. Well, my favorite color is green, so let's make them green. Let's make sure that did that for everybody. Yep. And this is the different sections and make that a nice bright red. I'm just changing all the colors. Okay, there we go. Now we've got some people that are going to get on board. Let's just hope this works. We didn't test it. The other cars won't be really going because there's no one there. Well, this one might get stuck behind the other two. Got the inspector arriving again. This is all new. I'm probably going to have to get rid of two of the cars. Unless the, the second car just moves by itself. Oh, it does. No, we're all good. Anyone getting off? There's nowhere to really go. Okay, okay. Oh, that's right. You can go down that very long path. Where'd they go? There we go. Now they've got somewhere to go. But we should probably do that for um, all the stations. Oh, look how many people want to use the gondola now. Tell you where's. There'll be another one coming. Somewhere. There we go. And look at this magnificence of this gondola in in, in the gas zoo. As I said, this um, does take a little while. Well, for me, it does anyway to get this completely correct. It's not it's not intuitive at all. It's just something that you have to practice and. Um, 
again, again, if you've played Planet Coaster, you'd probably be like all right with this because most of Planet Coaster is setting up things like this. Although I do like that they've added it in Planet Zoo so that you can have something something transporty for the uh, guests to transport in. Where's the where's the where's the next cable car? They've got a big queue forming here. Okay, we got that with nobody on board. We've got you. And we got you. Why isn't anything moving? Oh, there we go. You're finally moving. You're not moving, and you're not moving. Well, well those people are going to have to wait for quite some time, I think. Okay, so we've got that going. We'll, we'll keep an eye on it, make sure it's working properly, but that seems to be a pretty good gondola ride, which um, covers a, lot of, a big portion of the zoo. So, nice. Very nice. So, let's build some more habitats. If we go into our animal market, we'll see appeal. Yeah, we've got Ethel elephants, polar bear, gorilla. We've got oh, that's right. Did I have anything in the animal? No, I didn't. All right, people want to see lions. These can be a bit tricky because you can only ever have one male lion, maybe two, um, in an enclosure. So you have to keep, um, once the, the, the cubs grow up into a male, uh, an adult male, you have to then get them out of the zoo because otherwise the males will fight. But we're going to get a male and a female. Um, I don't know what they're conservation status is critically endangered all right we're going to start a breeding program with them okay so they need a grade three climb proof of four meters it's quite a big area that they need too they don't need anything else so grade three climb proof four meters Glass looks pretty good. Oh, it's raining in my zoo. That's climbable. It's no good. It's not high enough. Yeah, I think we'll just go for normal glass. That seems to be all right. But we'll make it four meters There's our habitat gate, and we're going to put in the usual suspects. Oh, I can hardly see the water I'm about to build. Well, I can't really see it, so um, calm or rough. We'll do rough. There we go, that's nice, and I'll need a habitat, of course. Sorry, a shelter. They all need a habitat.
I'll give them the African shelter because they're an African animal. And let's get some education. Let's get our education on. Okay, got those done. I'm anticipating that the lion is not going to want long grass. So I'm going to give it a mow right now. If only mowing was this easy in real life. There we go. Ah, there goes that gondola. And now, of course, we need to do our work zony stuff. One lions. And for our work zones, vet one. Yeah, you can also take care of the lions. And we need a keeper to look after things. You can go to the lions. I'll also set your food to be better. Oh, well, why can't I do that yet? I can maybe probably only do that once they're in there. Well, here comes the caretaker. Yeah, the caretaker with the box of lions. Here we go. Awesome. Now can I set their food? Yes, I can. There we go. Grade three. Give them the best food we can. Let's get that. Okay, so let's now have a look at how they're feeling. Big enough area. They need more rock. Where did all the long grass go, I wonder? No, I'll just put it over here. environment if i mean i could add some stuff or well, maybe i should add just a little bit of stuff okay enrichment cardboard box and large ball Give them one more. They don't seem to like to play with things. Prey scented sack. That's very good. And now we need food. Frozen blood pumpkin, piñata. These are pretty common for um, carnivores. There we go. Super happy lion. Yeah, 
Yep. You look pretty happy. Oh, there you are. Oh, you did come from the vet. You're sick. Yep, you're super happy. Oh, you've had offspring. There's the baby. Oh, aren't you cute? Aren't you cute? Wow, look at the poop. You are not cute. That is an enormous amount of pooping. So there's the zoo as it stands. Uh, I think we might end the video there. We added a couple of things. Um, hopefully you got something out of seeing me build the, the gondolas because all the transport rides are similar that you need to add them in a looping track and put stations somewhere for the um, the guests to get in and get off. So uh, did my best with the gondola. It's working, so that's the main thing. Added the lions, which is great, um, and fixed up the orangutan. So very productive episode i hope you enjoyed seeing another episode of planet zoo um, i do intend to keep um, doing some more content on planet zoo but uh, basically still just to show off some of the the cooler animals and, and some of the other things about planet zoo that are um, worth noting so i hope you enjoyed seeing that but as always au revoir vivida sing arrivederci adios ki ora sayonara dos vachanya over and out. This is not a dream. This is not a dream.